Well, greetings, friends, and welcome to the Midweek Update. I'm Pastor Tao, and I come to you today from several different locations, but starting here in the great outdoors, where it's a little bit chilly today, but not too cold. So hang on to your elf hats and hang on for a dramatic conclusion to our video for today. First of all, I want to say thank you to our children's ministries leaders, to the kids themselves, as well as to the music ministries for the uh, just incredible job they've done these last two weeks in leading us in worship. You're all amazing and your hard work is greatly appreciated. And speaking of amazing, here are our Christmas week reminders. Number one, if you or your family would like to light the Advent candles at the one o'clock service on Christmas Eve, please contact the ministry office. This is a limited time offer. Operators are standing by, so call now at 330-725-4943. Our Christmas Eve schedule itself is as follows. Christmas Eve on the square at 1 o'clock. Bring an umbrella, just in case, and a chair if you'd like to be seated. Then we'll be in the sanctuary at 5 o'clock p.m. on Christmas Eve, where it'll be nice and warm and dry. And then back on the square at 9 o'clock, Again, remind you to bring an umbrella, just in case, as well as a chair if you'd like to be seated. And then on Sunday, December 26th, we'll have one service, say one service, at 10 o'clock, say 10 o'clock, in the sanctuary. So just be reminded of, reminded of our altered schedule for that day. In all of these opportunities, friends, let's be about inviting our friends, our neighbors, and our families to share the joy and to share the celebration with and speaking of sharing the joy, I want to say thanks to the trustees for all of their hard work in getting the automatic doors installed. Now, when the church is open to the public or open for worship, all you have to do as you approach the building is push the button and you'll be able to enter the church without having to mess with the doors. And if you happen to stop by during the week, you'll do what you've always done. I'm talking slow so the door has time to close. You'll walk up to the door and you'll push the magic doorbell button, which is located right here. And then you wait. Can I come in where it's warm, please? Thank you. And voila. Automatic entrance into the church again where it's nice and warm and dry. This is not the only automatic door, however. Not just at the main doors, we also now have an automatic door at the family bathroom on the main level. But be informed, in order to be uh, avoiding any surprises, you need to be informed. So stay tuned, I'll be back with you in just a moment. Well, as promised, here we are inside the church where it's nice and warm at the family bathroom on the main level of the church. Again, automatic doors have been installed thanks to the trustees and thanks for your contributions that make these sort of things happen. So it's pretty simple, except for one important step. Pretty simple, you walk up. If the green light is off, that means the bathroom is available because the door is unlocked. So you walk up, push the button, and then, oh, uh, this stall is occupied. Here we are on the inside of the same family bathroom. Jesse has now left the building. Amen to that. So one important step in here, friends, is simply this. That locks the door. Out there, green means stop. In here, green means go. And then when you're finished your business, you wash your hands with soap. And when you're ready to leave, you're good to go. Well, in all seriousness, friends, I uh, just want to wish you and yours a very Merry Christmas. Celebrate well this Christmas season and remember what it's all about. We hope to see you Christmas Eve. God bless you. We'll see you soon. Merry Christmas.